Hi guys, how are you doing? So today we're going to be doing another opening, so I was actually quite lucky to get some more Shining Fate. So what the story is, is that it's basically uh, my local Asda do sell Pokemon cards, but it's nearly always impossible to get them from there. They're always sold out instantly. And I was actually there the other day, and they were putting out Shining Fate's mini tins when I got there. I took, I took a little picture, which I'll put up now, so they had loads. So I thought, well, might as well get some. They were £8 each, though, the cheapest I've ever seen them, so I wasn't going to be that guy. I just bought up all of them in one go and left none for anybody else. So that kind of what happens to me. Now I've got to go there and there's nothing left. So what I did was I just bought the three uh, tins just to complete the artwork set so that I had one of each artwork. So we just got three tins. So we've got six packs today. So if they are the same kind of pull rates as what they were in the previous openings, I'm up for a very good opening. Uh, try not to be disappointed if it's not. But I've got quite high hopes on these being... A very good opening and having good pull rates just like we did on the, the last last video that we did. So that's the Cairo we've got working inside. Just gonna put this tin on one side. Have a little look on the tin there, you see there's never shiny Pokemon. There's always a shiny Pokemon on each one. This one is like a little shiny snob on the bottom there. So the first one we got is a Dragapult artwork set. So let's see what we can get out of this. So you're already done so guys please consider hitting that subscribe button and liking this video and leaving up leaving, leaving a comment down below. Darix, Horsey, Katnia, Morpetlo, Chudel, Goes a few, Reverse, Float, Zell, and it's just a celebrity regular rare. So nothing in that one. You never know what you're gonna get in these as well because all of the uh, packs that you get have all, all got these white cords in. So generally if you get a regular like, non-special uh, pack it's going to have a with a white or a green cord in. So if you get a white cord you know you've got something uh, good. If it's a green cord you know it's nothing. But on these ones they're all white unfortunately so it means you've got no idea if it's going to be good or nothing in them. But you've got a reverse reprint of Decidueye. So that first tin was a bit of a disappointment. So. No shinies, no Vs, no fallouts. So last time we good, did get about three out of the four packs had hits in them. So that is the artwork for the the root tin. Just pretty same kind of all of them. Oh, same artwork in these ones as well. We've got another drag up and another toxic tricky. They're quite a good like shaped tin as well, they actually do fit the pack in so the packs aren't squashed. If you look at like the Pokeball tins and you'll find that them that they are always uh, like squashed in. I think I'll give this one away though. I think this one's got some good and so let's get to the end of this pack. So we've got Leaf Energy, Eldegoss, Rusted Shield, Cramorant, Cacnea, Coughing, Snom, Years of Pleur, Kufand. Oh it's a shiny coffin. And ooh, it's a full art. Cara, this trainer, but there's a shiny coffin. And there, but look at the mist, look at the center on this, look how thick that border is. That is really bad centering on the front. But, anyways, so that is one pack with two hits in it, so that's good, that's a shiny. And a full art, so I'm restoring my faith in these shiny tins. I'll definitely pick up a few of these tins if you get a chance. Because it looks like a kind of like 50 50. I think I'm going to have something in. Or something. Or nothing in at all. So either going to have something really good or going to have some or nothing in at all. But generally, I think you're going to have at least one pack that's going to have something in. Or the odd tin, you might have both packs that got something in. I think there's something in the pack here as well. So Snum. Here's a flu. Ooh, it's shiny Grim Snarl V. Animal Peckle V. So that's number two hits there. Wow. Fantastic. I love it. That's, that is the first shiny V full art that we've had as well. Look at that. That's, I love that. I love the shiny form of Grim Snarl as well. It's an absolutely fantastic looking card. Right, so last tin. So really what would open something. I'll be really amazed 
if we uh, manage to get the shiny Charizard. But I'm not holding my breath out too much because it'll probably not happen, but we'll see what happens with this. Right. Now I think I've given it away again. I'm going to call it and say I think it's a shiny Toxitricity V in this one. I think I saw the colouring on it. So we'll see. Oh, it's not. It's a reverse rookie. And it's a cruel bad V Max. Ooh, nice. To be honest, I don't think anyone's going to be really using the cruel bad V Max because I think they're going to just keep the regular crowbar for the regular crowbar's ability. They don't usually get used, the crowbar's. I'll have a little read of that. Yeah, uh, Crowbar VMAX at the end, so I want to see what it does. Right, didn't give it away, so either it's got nothing in it, or I didn't give it away. Thwacky, Cromorant, Brizzle, Nickit, Crabinch, Slum, Gears of Fleur, Reverse Rotom, and it's a Man Feed. So no, I was going to say no shines, but we did, we've got, a, we've got two shines. That was six packs. We got... Crobat VMAX, so it says your opponent's active Pokemon is now poisoned, switch this Pokemon, you'll bench Pokemon, and max card is 108 damage, so probably not the most playable card. This is probably the pull of the opening. It's actually got good sentiment. Maybe it's a little bit off from top to bottom. And right, that's just, it's got OP sentiment, I'd see. Maybe it's 8, an 8 out of 10 in the sentiment. A little bit of a nip on the corner there, and that corner at the bottom. Uh, let's see, probably 7 or an 8 for that one. That's a good, nice, really, really nice looking card. We put this in the after. This is just like a reprint of the promo, to be honest, so nothing too special about that one. Very off centering on this Coralis. Search your deck up with two rare fossils and put them in your, on your pens. It's kind of the card that you kind of use in a deck, like this is not the kind of card you would get graded. You would probably just use it like to an actual tournament. And I, I really like this uh, shiny coffin as well. Again, I think the centering on most of these cards are off from left to right. I think it must just be the way they've been printed. We've got like a little bit of a like, thing down the side there, so you can see there's like a shine coming off it. So that is kind of like off like the the, uh, the print. Obviously, it's been it's meant to be cut slightly over. It hasn't. It's got like a little hollow in there. So imagine if that card was like next to it, next to it on the uh, on the same sheet when it was printed. What it's done is it's cut some like a slight bit off one side, and that is what's made the shine stay on the side of the card there. But yeah, it's really, it's like these are like, these like shiny reverses are like all textured and everything, so they look really really nice. Such a deck for a card of all sorts. Put put on that Pokemon involve it. That is actually really good because there is another card which we did get in the last opening, which I've still got here because I haven't put them away yet. Which is the Galarian reason. So you could use that attack ascension and then it would come into this card in the next turn, and you would have the evolved Galarian reason. But anyways, guys, that's it for the DS member. Please hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, leave a comment, and I will see you guys in the next video, which I'm really looking forward to because I am getting back my get graded cards very soon. So they should be back within maximum of two weeks and I should be uploading that video as soon as I get them back and we'll see what grades them cards get but anyways I'll see you then bye for now